Hey guys, I go by the name of Illuminous Eyes. I'm here to illuminate the motherfucking wise, okay? Today we got a really quick message for Aries, all right? So let's get into that motherfucker. Peace and prosperity to unto all of you guys. I hope all of you guys have a peaceful mind and a peaceful heart, okay? Thank you guys for all of your likes, comments, shares, subscribes. I genuinely appreciate it. You guys can follow me on all social media by the same name, Illuminous Eyes. I interact, all right? So what's up? Anyway, let's get into this message. What's the most important message, please, for Aries? Aries, I'm feeling like you're feeling really tranquil, really calm, really relaxed, okay? But well, this is something that you should be seeking to do for the weekend. Just seek some type of tranquil energy, okay? Yeah, I'm giving. I'm getting that someone could be giving you this as advice. You needing rest, or you need a. You need to find some peace. Okay, this could be coming from a water sign. Okay, because I, I feel like you're unbalanced right now. You're feeling a little off. Okay, you might. You might even be feeling like um. You don't feel like being bothered. You feel like uh. You just want to be to yourself. Okay. Now an air sign. Um. This could be a a a. A Libra, they could be acting like this, kind of cold, withdrawn, isolated. They don't really have much to say, okay? Um, they could be spending a lot of time online or on their phone or in their phone, like just scrolling. You know what I mean? Now, this could also be a, a fire sign, okay? I'm getting that in the future, um, this person's going to start acting real um, secretive, um, now, this can also be a cancer that's acting this way. This person could have been acting this way for the last two weeks, two days. But I'm getting that, like, somebody's been acting really moody, okay? This could be you, but Aries, um, I'm just saying. I'm also getting that um, on the, there's something coming up in the future regarding the moon, the full moon cycle, or, or your connection with the cancer, Aries, okay? Can I get a card, please, for Aries? Yeah, I'm getting I'm getting that you're... you're, you're you found your your love partner. This could be a Leo or an air sign. I'm getting that um, they were sent to you, okay? Okay, you could be texting this person a lot at night. Okay, I'm also getting some of you guys could be having communication problems as far as like your internet or phone, okay? Okay, so I'm also getting that you guys could be having a conversation in regards, a, a sexual conversation and someone wants you to come over, okay? I'm also getting that you guys are, are, are spending a lot of time on the phone and I'm getting like this, like um, a miscommunication or literally a disconnection, okay? This person, this could, this person could be a, 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 a Capricorn as well. Aries, I'm also getting that um, you haven't been working out, but your body looks great. Especially, especially for those that just gave birth three weeks ago. Some of you guys are literally on some celibacy shit right now, Aries. I feel like you're, I, I feel like you're waiting for someone to come back to you before you embark on sex. Like you're waiting for someone. Okay, you're waiting for to give up that dick or that pussy. Yeah, Ace of Wands. Okay, I'm getting that you're waiting to get someone pregnant as well, a Cancer or a, a Capricorn. I'm also yeah, I'm also getting you can't sleep without this person at night. Okay, you miss them. I don't know what where they are or why they're not around. I'm, I'm but I feel like you're missing them. They could be working a lot. I'm also getting that someone's mad that you're not spending enough time at home. Okay, you could be someone that travels for a living. Or someone that just works double shifts, okay? But I'm getting that someone gets really irritated by that, okay? So can I get um, one more card at the top, please, for Aries? This have a, a, a big emphasis on um, a Capricorn feels like that. They're mad that you're not at home enough, okay? I, I also feel like someone feels like you're hanging around with the wrong person or the wrong people. So especially if they're younger than you I'm also getting that someone is deciding to not speak to you anymore or they're, they're trying to decide to what they want to present to you in a conversation or about your relationship with them now you could be dealing with someone that's younger than you and you're the older woman that's very prominent a older woman younger man situation here okay Aries can I get one card please at the top 
this one wants to smack me in the face but i'm getting aries you have nothing to wor worry about i'm getting that this person has been trying to relieve your mind through conversation through communication okay i'm getting that this person is really serious about being with you okay or or or, or being celibate But I feel like I feel like Aries, you still feel like someone is unloyal or they have the potential to cheat or leave you. But they're really they're really an honest, loyal person and very serious about being with you or embarking on a journey of a relationship with you. Okay, yeah, the justice card keeps coming out. We have the justice card, the king of swords. Like I'm getting like you you deal with someone that could possibly work for the uh, um this could be the court system. This could be any like um, <clears throat> legal service job. I'm also getting that someone is extremely intelligent and they have good communication. So you have nothing to worry about. They 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 explained everything that you need to know. Some of you guys could be staying up way too late, and you need to take um, um, control of your like your sleeping habits or your sleeping patterns. Okay, you need to balance your, balance your sleeping patterns out because you're spending a lot of time up at night talking to a cancer or an air sign. Okay, more messages in other words, please for Aries. Let me pick up another card deck. More messages, please for Aries. So we have the Empress coming out. So there's also about to be a major change too with the women in your life if you're an Aries man. Okay. I'm also I'm also getting that um if you're a woman, you're about to become pregnant. I feel like someone's I feel like to be very honest with you, I feel like Aries, you're about to have two women pregnant. And if you're a woman, I feel like you're about to have twins. Or you're about to get pregnant for a second time. Okay. Can I get a can I get a card, please, for Aries? One card, please, for Aries, regarding the Six of Swords, please. The Six of Swords in reverse. Why is this here, please, for Aries? Why is the Six of Swords here, please, for Aries? I really appreciate it. Thank you. So, I'm, okay, so I'm getting the, I'm, oh. <laughs> Okay, this goes in two different ways because I the way the way that I read the Six of Cups. First and foremost, I feel like um, some of you guys are leaving um, uh, your your baby mama. Okay, they're too controlling. Okay, and I, I feel like you're just done worrying about the situation. Like you're just done working it out for the children. You, it, it's just like I hear someone saying, "I'm just gonna leave well enough alone." That's first. That's for some Aries. Okay, others of you, I feel like. Um, this could be your ex <clears throat> wanting to come back to you and you're not sure on if you should be with this person. You guys have good conversation, but there's an imbalance in your emotions. But you're, you're hoping that this person has changed in some way or you're hoping that... Um, That maybe you guys could talk something out and, and, and find an equal ground, but I feel like I feel like this person is emotionally unstable. Okay, I also feel like this person could possibly be selfish. Okay, um, I also feel like you, this is for one or two Aries in specific. You could be dealing with someone that if you have children with them, they want you to put them first above everything, even the children. This is like one of those situations catered to your man and then everything else type of situation that's a lot but moving on others of you i feel like this person that's embarking on a relationship with you aries they're literally from your past life genuinely your past life this person has come to you several times in this life in different people forms okay I'm getting that in your past life, you guys had children together, two of them to be exact. I said this in another reading. And I'm getting that in the in a journey, um, someone may have cheated or felt like, um, you know, like, like uh, there's one of two things that's happening here because this is different for everybody. The past situation, someone cheated, that's what caused the breakup, okay? And you're here to bring this back together. You're here to amend this, okay? Others of you... Um, Someone had poor health in the past life. Ace of Cups in the reverse. Um, 
uh, nine of cups in reverse okay and then we have the star card star everybody knows the star card for me is all about health okay moving on from that message can I get a reason why I'm also getting that um you kind of keep going back to the past okay the past your past relationships worry you they keep you stuck from moving on into the new relationships okay i feel like every time every time aries you you think that you're getting one foot ahead you start thinking about your past relationships and how much pain you've been through okay so this is part of your journey letting go of pain letting go of painful memories okay can I get a card, please? I'm also getting that your your baby mother or your mother may give you um, some bad news in regards to the children. Okay, they may, they may have some news or or, or a, a regards to their house. I feel like a baby mother is having a, a financial situation happening, and they may need help. Okay, now this could also be your mother or your siblings. But moving on from that message, I'm also getting that there could be a Capricorn or. Um, yeah, a Capricorn or a water sign, heavy, a, heavy, a heavy emphasis on um, a Scorpio or a Pisces. That's all for self. They're very selfish, okay? I'm also getting that somebody's dick whipped here. And that's what's causing also an emotional imbalance, Aries. Okay, you could kind of be dip whipped by a, a water sign, a, a fellow fire sign. Um, heavy emphasis on um, a Leo or a Sagittarius. Okay, any water sign, Scorpio, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, any air sign, um, Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius, heavy emphasis on Libra, okay? Can I get a card, please, for why is the um, Nine of Swords in reverse? I'm getting that you're worried if you're making the right decision or you're worried if someone's lying or holding, some, holding information back to you about a third party. Can I get a card, please, for why the King of Swords is here, please? Why is the King of Swords here? Now, this could be, like I said, this could be... Um, someone that you're older older younger with dynamic this could be um news coming from your sister this could be news coming from your baby mama this could be news coming from your husband your brother i just feel like somebody's worried that someone's not giving them the full details or the full story about a situation but i'm getting that you're going to get clarity and balance okay it, i'm getting that you may not you may not have to do too much to get this type of information you may just have to go to a capricorn or go to a, a, a sagittarius or any fire sign and ask them what you're thinking about or what kind, what kind of information you need to know okay i'm getting if this has anything to do with legal a legal situation okay i'm getting um, especially like uh, child support i'm getting that um a, a, a child's mother may be getting some bad news about one of their children but not the other one okay I, but I'm getting that everything in the end is going to work out for you. Don't worry. It's just a slow process or else I'm getting that something's just on hold. Okay? Something's just on hold. Yeah. I'm, I'm getting that it's going to it's going to come off a hold in the next three days or three months. This could even be three weeks. I genuinely didn't mean to say three days. So I'm getting three days. I'm getting... <clears throat> If you guys are waiting for a specific document in the mail, I feel like, I feel like, I don't know what this document is, but I feel like it's been rejected. I also wanted to say that too. I feel like someone's I don't I don't know who this is, but I'm gonna say someone's girlfriend or baby mama is very promiscuous around a a, a, a ear sign. I'm also getting that like somebody's waiting for um waiting for your for you to go to go to work so they could be with your baby mama or your husband. I'm also getting that the the truth the truth is from this uh, Capricorn or this Empress. The Empress to me can is Capricorn energy, but like I feel like whoever this Empress is is extremely bored in the situation that they are in with you, but they can't. Then they, they haven't said that. Like they don't want to be in the relationship with you no more, or they they they're not telling you that like. 
they're not they don't desire you sexually anymore or something like that aries now this could be you you could be bringing news to this empress because we have the page of wands in reverse on top of the empress i feel like you could be bringing news to your baby mama that could that that could possibly have her in worry or in crisis but i feel like it's really not that big of a deal okay I'm, I'm also getting that someone is hounding you to take the kids or hounding you to come pick up the kids and bring them to bring them somewhere but i feel like you don't have a vehicle or you don't have you don't have money or something like that Can I get a card, please, for why the Six of Wands is here? That's what I wanted to do. Hold on for one second. I wanted to get a different perspective. Because I need to understand. Yeah, I was kind of getting that, too. I feel like, Aries, I feel like your baby mama's going to come to you and tell you that they're still in love with you. But I feel like, I feel like you've moved on. To an air sign or you moved on to another fire sign i also feel like you're gonna make something very clear to to someone in your life or a, a woman or your or the women is like because the empress came out twice three times i i feel like i feel like you I, i'm also getting that like you've made a decision uh, uh, to to go left <laughs> go that way <laughs> Like, I feel like you, you you, literally have made a concrete decision that I guess you chose someone. You chose to be with someone. And it's not your baby mama and it's not this side bitch. Or it's not your baby daddy and it's not this side dude. Moving on from that. <clears throat> I'm getting soon as you bring this news, they start crying. And telling you how much they love you and they don't want you to go and they want you to think about it again and all of that. Can I get a card please for this uh, Six of Swords? Why is the Six of Swords here please? Why is the Six of Swords here for Aries? I'm also hearing an Aries saying I can't wait to get married. I can't wait to have children. I feel like you've been having a lot of dreams about children and marriage lately. Some I'm also hearing fish. So I'm getting there's an Aries that's been dreaming about fish. Okay. It says you can have it all. Okay, so I'm getting that your ex is coming back to you trying to offer you anything that you want. They want to be with you. Moving on from that. Can I get a card please for the Empress and the Page of Wands here? Why is the Empress and the Page of Wands here, please? Can you make it clear? I feel like, Aries, you need to connect with the color yellow and red. It says love. Yeah, red. Love. I'm getting that someone is trying to tell you that they love you so much. They want to be with you forever. They want you to have their children. They want you to be part of their your, your future. I'm also getting that this person feels very familiar to you. Like you've been in this relationship with them before. I'm also getting that, Aries, you keep getting deja vu. You, I'm also feeling like you've seen this person in your dreams or you feel like you've, you just feel way too familiar with this person. I don't know why I'm hearing that, but it could be that too. I'm hearing free at last, free at last. Good God almighty, I'm free at last. So I'm getting that someone's heart chakra is now open. I'm also getting that someone is being released from jail early, two to three weeks early. But I'm getting that if you're going to your baby mother's house, I'm getting that like you can't stay there. Moving on. Can I get a card please for the um, nine of swords and the two of swords please? Both of them reverse. Why is this card here? Why is this card here for Aries? Oh, I did see that in the reading. I don't even know if I said it. I'm getting Aries. You're so fucking worried that you're never going to see this person the love of your life again i'm getting you guys keep trying to make travel plans but there's major delays from from being able to see this person they could live in another state another country 
okay? I'm getting that I'm getting that you're so stressed out because all you want to do is just love this person, kiss this person, hold this person. Okay, and the next card that I fell out with that is everything is okay. I'm getting that this person keeps trying to tell you everything's okay. I'm going to see you soon. Don't worry. I love you. I will do anything for you. You could have met this person three weeks ago and this is how strong the love is. It's because they're from your past life. Six, six of swords. Six of swords, six of cups. Double sixes. Every journey that you've taken in love, I feel like it was to lead you back to this person. Can I can I have a card please? Can I get a card please for the King of Swords and the Three of Wands, please for Aries? Why is this here? Why is the King of Swords and the Three of Wands here? <laughs> it says, where's my money? Where's my money? So I'm getting Aries. You keep trying to reach out to a, a, a um, an air sign and ask them for your money. But I'm getting that someone keeps trying to like, um, this could be a loved one. This could even be your baby mama. Like they keep reaching out to you and asking you for money, but you don't have it or I, they keep t they, I'm getting like someone you someone owes someone something someone owes someone everything because they've done so much they they've spoiled you so much they've given you anything and everything that you've wanted all right I'm also the top of the card is be a man I'm getting now it's time for you to be a man and take care of these kids you know love this baby mama love your wife love your girlfriend it's time to stop playing games it's time to stop hanging out in the street or it's, it's time to be a better man. Before you lose this woman, this empress. Okay. Can I get a card, please? <clears throat> You guys could be dealing with all those other zodiac signs that I said. I'm going to go over them again. Can I get a card, please, for Aries? The first card out is blue. So you guys could definitely be dealing with an air sign. Okay? It says, shit is going down with your job. Reevaluate. Change your perspective or fucking quit. Whoa, whoa, wait, 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 wait. Okay, hold the fuck on. So, Aries, I'm getting that you're bringing someone. You you may have to fire a, a a a mother. Okay, I'm getting this person keeps showing up late or something's happening here in regards to. I feel like you're the you're the boss. You're the CEO. Um, I'm getting that someone used to work from home, and they like fucking up. They're fucking up clocking in late or fucking up the working somehow now other than that i'm getting that you may have you <laughs> it was you may walk into work and get some bad news from your boss in the next three days two days you're being cautious not to worry Don't stress that shit, okay? I'm getting that you're going to have something better coming to you, something more just, okay? Just hold on. The next card is, you got a feeling, just can't shake it. That little voice inside your head, listen to that shit. It's purple, closest to blue, so that's going to give me energy of an air sign or water. I'm getting that you need to follow your gut feeling, okay? I'm also getting that you you can't help the feeling of feeling like you've known this person your whole life. Or you can't help the feeling of, of I don't know, wanting to be with this person. 
I'm also getting that um, it says um, shit's about to go down with my job. I'm getting that your job has been withholding your check for the last three weeks or two weeks. This could be a couple of days, but I'm getting that every time you ask for your check, there's a problem. Okay, I feel like you need to go to like straight to human resources or I, I'm getting like your job also has been skimming money off of your check without your you don't even notice it because it's like a huge cent or a dollar every time. I feel like you need to reevaluate your check. I'm also getting that someone keeps trying to pay you and everything but money. I watch your children. I'll clean your house. I'll take you anywhere you want to go. Bitch, no. I need my shmoney. Okay? Fuck wrong with you. Can't live off fucking love. Moving on. 